my name is Hannah Niebuhr. Um, I am a social anthropologist here at the Max Planck Institute for Social Anthropology. Social anthropology intrigues me um, for two reasons. So first of all, I'm really interested in the multiplicity with which people um, live the world, um, understand the world, make sense of the world. And I think it's a great challenge to um, get into these life worlds of the people and try to understand, try to make sense of how they make sense of the world. So that's the one thing. The second thing is that I um, find that social anthropology has a great repertoire of uh, reflexivity um, and that pertains to um, the, um, the processual character in which we do research and the relational character with which we re do research with people and in interaction with people. Um, and I think with reflexivity, social anthropology does justice to how this research comes into being. My current research project is about the emergence of astronomy as a scientific discipline in Madagascar. So in Madagascar, you, you already have a great tradition of astrology, so people relate to the sky in a particular way. But now astronomy and the universality of the scientific discipline is being introduced in Madagascar. Um, this is happening in the context of a satellite dish that is currently being transformed into a telescope. Um, and this telescope will then be connected to other telescopes on the African continent to actually um, turn Africa into a giant ear to listen into the universe. Um, so this astronomy emergence in Madagascar also brings Madagascar closer to the African continent in an ideological way. I'm particularly interested in how the students make sense of this development. The, the, so the students of astronomy in Madagascar, they have a lot of outreach activities explaining to the public the value of a universally scientific astronomy to relate to the sky. So my new research project um, is targeted to bring a lot of new insights. Um, primarily, I hope that it will bring some insights into how we understand the relation that humanity forms with, in relation to the sky, in, re in relation to outer space. So I hope that this relation between humanity and outer space is something that will be very prominent in my research. Um, the particularity of doing this research in Madagascar also brings a couple of other insights. For example, the infrastructure that binds Madagascar closer to Africa with which it has an ambivalent relation. This is one of the things. Then also the relation between Madagascar and Earth and how planetary entanglements of global inequalities figure um, into this project. So astronomers claim to be uh, the same all over the world, they're engaged in the same project, but then there are of course global inequalities in which research can be done and is being carried out. Um, and then finally I'm interested in cosmological questions of how within astronomy the configuration of humanity and outer space is being configured and all of these sca scales, so um, Madagascar and Africa, Madagascar and the Earth, Madagascar, and outer space. Um, I'm interested in how these scales relate to each other and how they make sense of each other. <laughs>